Belgium. Belgium is a kingdom, it's a Belgium kingdom. Belgium. In this episode of the Brothers League Tackle Europe, is that what we're calling it? I guess we are now. We're tackling Belgium. And by Belgium, I mean the country next to France, Germany, and Luxembourg. We are making Belgium's national dish, which is Mouls Marinaire, which translates as Mussels Marinaire? Mussels of the Sea. We're going to go with that. If you'd like to make Mussels of the Sea at home, you will need 300 grams of mussels, one tub of creme fraiche, one carrot, one leek. An onion, one chilli, one stalk of celery, whatever oregano this is, some beer. Firstly, you will need to clean your mussels. No, oh, they're all clean. Next, you will need to prepare your vegetables. We are using a basic mil milpois. The basic mil milpois is carrots, leeks. I must have carrots here, Matt. <laughs> Carrots, leeks, yeah. carrots, <laughs> leeks, celery, and onion. Why don't you tell the uh, lovely folks some interesting facts about Belgium? <laughs> it's near Germany. Their flag is ye red and yellow. And black. And black. Belgian girls are hot, I guess. Um, mussels, they're from Belgium. <laughs> they're from France. Mussels are from the sea. Pete, why don't you tell the folks at home facts about Belgium? Belgium is landlocked on three sides. Belgium also has the most castles per square mile in Europe. Fact. Really? Probably. Right, so let's start cutting this stuff up, because we probably should cook something at some point. Oh, I'm a little bit drunk. Now all the prep is done, now it's time to cook this. Chuck in some olive oil. Or rapeseed oil. I've got rapeseed oil. Throw in your onions. Carrots. Celery. And leeks. Now give it a little wiggle. That's probably enough. Cook this mess until it's brown. No, not brown. Cook this mess until it's golden. Done. Next, throw in your mussels. Followed by your beer. We've gone Belgium. And cover. Now cook that for, well, I don't know, a few minutes and stuff here. A good amount of time. Good amount. No, not a good amount of time. Enough time. M mussels. Now lob in your chilli and your oregano and a tablespoon of creme fraiche and cover. In hindsight I'm going to stir that about because that looks like cat sick. <laughs> now cook for another minute. It's like free hands in there. Cook for another minute <laughs> and then voila, à voila. Oh! Season to taste. And then garnish with chilli. Mm. Oregano. I'm going to hand this over to Matt now, who's never eaten a muscle before. <laughs> and is a really picky eater. Using your hands like a, like a bloody savage out here, right? <laughs> Can I dip him in the sauce? Yeah, I, I recommend it. I also recommend using cutlery. <laughs> but, you know. You a dick. I'm going to do it how it's yeah. supposed to be done. Use one muscle shell to pick out a nut. Oh, there he goes. See, I'm intelligent. Thanks for putting that straight back in the rest of the It's not like I want to eat any of these or anything. I like those muscles. Hooray! Hooray! Success. Now that, it, now that we know Matt likes muscles, let's go see what the general public think. To the streets! Hi, we're out on the street and we're going to see if the general public want to try our mussels. Here comes someone now. Hello, madam. Would you like to try... Hello. <laughs> Hello, sir. Would you like to try one of our mussels? I've got a fork. <laughs> yeah, why not? 
Yeah, yeah, exactly. Why not? Why would you? Why not? He likes them. Hello, sir. Hello. Has anyone ever told you look like a white Samuel Jackson? Several times. Has some muscles. Oh, using the fork. He's using the fork. Civilized. This fella. Orgasmic. Thank you. Orgasmic. You hear that? Oh, look. There's someone else coming now. Has anybody ever told you you look like a black Samuel Jackson? No, no one. What's this? This is uh, muscles. Oh, good. <laughs> Just be punchy, Matt. Just say next week, blam, we're cooking this. Okay. Next week, we'll be cooking Cyprus food, which is on the Greek islands, which is Greece. So next week, we'll be cooking Greece. No, you just said two countries there, Matt. Next week, we'll be cooking Cypriot food, which is Cyprus. <laughs>